Hello everybody, this will be a short tutorial on how to add swap in Debian or Ubuntu. First of all, let's log in as root, because most of the commands require root privileges. Type in su space dash. When we are root, let's check our swaps by typing swap on dash s. You can see I already have one swap which is mounted to the partition. Actually, this is the best way how to create swap so that you will get the best performance. But if you don't have partition, you can also create your swap in a regular file, which is also OK. Let's do it now. And let's allocate the file, an empty file, by using command F allocate dash L and then file size. Let's say we want swap of 500 megabytes and then path to the file I'll place it in a root directory swap file also we need to change permissions so that only root can access that file that is required by security reasons type in change mode 600 and then path to the file now we need to format it as swap space, type in mk swap path to the file, swap file. Now we are ready to activate it by typing swap on path to the file, which is swap file again. And it is active and let's check it by typing swap on dash s. You can see now I have two swaps. One is in the partition and another in the regular file. Next thing that you need to do is to make your changes permanent so that on every boot of your machine your swap file will be activated and mounted as swap. Uh, to do that we need to edit this file which is located at Etsy fstab. Open it with any text editor, I will do it with nano and simply add one line at the bottom slash swap file space none space swap space sw00 and now save the file and exit let's also try to run this command mount dash a to make sure there are no errors there. And now we are ready to reboot the machine. Type in reboot and let's wait. The machine has booted successfully and now let's check our swaps by typing sudo swap on dash s enter the password and you can see that our swap file is active and I also have another swap which is in the partition which works great. I hope this was useful for you and thanks for watching.